Hi friends, already you read and know all about what is the Boyle's law. But here friends, we are discussing this topic Boyle's law in different way and try to relate it our bodies and daily life. Friends, you know, we are breathing 20 times per minute in whole life till death. So how does Boyle's law are related with our bodies we discuss in this video so first of all you related this lungs respiration and now we also use in blood stream so this is the whole topics you see all videos so friends first of all you know a brief of Boyle's law what is Boyle's law Charles law so Boyle's law friends if t equals to constant then this will become p1 v1 equals to p2 v2 p1 pressure and v equals to volume ok and also you related pv equals to constant p pressure and v equals to volume so friends if you related to charles law then if pressure equals to constant then what it will become v1 upon t1 equals to v2 upon t2 ok this is a volume now gay lussac law says that if volume equals to constant then what will become p1 upon t1 this is a temperature equals to p2 upon t2 ok this is charles law and combined law this if boyle's charles and gay lussac law are all together combined then it will become what p1 v1 divided by t1 equals to p2 v2 divided by t2 if t equals to constant then it will become Boyle's law if p equals to constant then it will become Charles law and if volume equals to constant then it will become Gay-Lussac law and what is the ideal gas law pv equals to n r t r equals to what ideal gas constant t equals to temperature and equals to number of moles v volume p pressure so this is a normal description of all about this laws but here friends we only consider this Boyle's law so what is Boyle's law Boyle's law say that pressure inversely proportional to volume what it means it means if pressure increases then volume decreases if volume increases then pressure will decreases and if you relate this then what will become this is a volume and this vertical line shows pressure then what will become this diagram will like this if pressure increase then volume will decrease if pressure increase then volume decreases if pressure decrease then volume increases so this is a Boyle's law and this law follow in our body in our lungs okay so the, see this descriptions friends this is a lungs trachea and this is a diaphragm friends you know our lungs are made up of spongy stretchy tissues which is expand and contract okay in during the breathing breathing systems friends you see here this is a general terminology of our lungs this is a trachea this is a bone these bones are called ribs this is a bronchi bronchus right bronchus and here left bronchus and this is a lungs alveoli this is a diaphragm and this is a lungs alveoli and inside lungs alveoli the pressure is called alveolar pressure the pressure is called alveolar pressure and this pressure is inside this lungs alveoli okay so friends you also know atmospheric pressure is also known as barometric pressure now the friends atmospheric pressure value 760 mm of hg okay and inside the lungs pressure also is 760 mm of hg and inside lungs pressure it will called Instafural pressure inside lungs pressure okay friends you see here clearly inside lungs pressure 
एंड एटमोस्फेरिक प्रेशर वैल्यूज आर इक्वल बोथ आर 760 सिक्सटी एम एम ऑफ एच जी एंड यू ऑल्सो नो एटमोस्फेरिक प्रेशर इक्वल्स टू वन बार इफ यू वॉन्ट टू कन्वर्ट दिस वैल्यू इन बार देन पी इक्वल्स टू रो जी एच पी इक्वल्स टू रो डेंसिटी ऑफ मरकरी ओके एच जी जी ग्रेविटी एच यू वैल्यू हाइट यू सी हियर दिस इज अ वैल्यू ऑफ सेवन सिक्सटी एच वैल्यू ओके सो मरकरी डेंसिटी सेवेंटी थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड मल्टीप्लाई नाइन पॉइंट एट वन मल्टीप्लाई यू पुट दिस दिस सेम एम कन्वर्टिंग मीटर एंड आफ्टर कैलकुलेशन यू गॉट वन बार सो यू नो इन साइड ह्यूमन बॉडी एंड आउटसाइड द ह्यूमन बॉडी दैट मीन्स इट मस्ट फीयर द वैल्यू इज सेम वन बार सो बॉथ वैल्यूज आर इक्वल सो हाउ कैन दिस पॉसिबल इन रेस्पिरेशन वॉट इज कंबाइनिंग प्रेशर इन साइड एंड आउटसाइड दिस हाउ कैन दिस पॉसिबल सो पॉसिबल इफ यू अप्लाई बॉयल्स ला देन दिस इंस्पिरेशन एंड एक्सपिरेशन इज पॉसिबल आउट ऑफ बॉयल्स ला दिस इज नॉट पॉसिबल सो वी अप्लाई बॉयल्स ला दिस प्रेशर इंक्रीज देन वॉल्यूम डिक्रीज इफ वॉल्यूम इंक्रीज देन प्रेशर डिक्रीज फ्रेंड्स when we inhale that is take oxygen and inside the bodies then our body diaphragm our body diaphragm intercostal muscles intercostal muscle what that is a muscles between ribs is known as intercostal muscle so friends if you inhale take oxygen inside our bodies then our intercostal muscles are contracting intercostal muscles are contracting and expanding chest cavity and expanding chest cavity and get volume lungs volume large here lungs volume increases then what will happen pressure will decreases this is a boyle's law so friends increase in lungs volume it leads to decrease in pressure okay decrease in pressure here boils law apply in this case air flow into the lungs air flow into the inside the lungs from higher pressure outside the higher pressure inside the lower pressure so we exhale the oxygen because in lungs pressure decrease and atmosphere pressure increase because inside the lungs volume increases and outside volume remain same so this is a process of inspiration that in taking oxygen friends when we exhale expiration then diaphragm and rib muscles relax okay rib muscles are relaxed chest cavity contracted chest cavity contracted and the lungs volume decreases if lungs volume decrease then pressure will increase and again here boils law apply so air flow out up the lungs from here pressure higher and here pressure lower so higher pressure to lower pressure okay and this process is continue our whole life inspiration and expiration and also we follow our whole life boils law so thank you friends you enjoy this and in next video we discuss about boils law in blood stream